Hello everyone, today I have a 90s look for you. This is um, definitely trendy, definitely what's in of the moment. And I wanted, to get, I wanted to show you the whole 90s look and you can do one or the other because I know um, both together it's a little bit too 90s, too trendy. The eyes are just like your um, taupes, <clears throat> cocoa colors, and it's definitely in that um, satin finish, which was um, the, the finish of the 90s. I don't think they even had matte finishes. And <clears throat> they didn't go for the sparkle. So it was definitely a satin finish. For the lips, I'm going with mattes. Um, kind of like a, not like matte lip, but more just, it's just like a soft matte finish if that makes sense. But definitely it's a brown. Other than the base, everything else is drugstore. So the blush, the eyeshadows, uh, mascara and lips are all drugstore. And um, I, I like doing that because I like to make it more accessible, especially when it's like a trend that um, is not gonna be here for very long. So um, let's go ahead and get started with the look. First thing I want to do is apply my foundation. I'm using the Makeup Forever HD foundation. My color is in 125 and I usually take two pumps of this. I'm going to spread it all over my face using the Delium, Delium 948 brush. And I'm going to blend that evenly with the Delium 955 Dual Fiber Brush. The concealer I'm going to use is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Custard Medium 1. This concealer is really very thick. To blend that away, I'm going to use the Delium 957 brush. It's just like a flat top brush. To set it all, I'm going to use my Tarte Amazonian Clay Smooth Operator. This is just like an HD powder. You really don't have to set it. The foundation um, kind of sets itself and the concealer definitely um, like dries and it sets itself but uh, I wanted to go ahead and use it <clears throat> just because that 90s look was very matte. Next I'm going to fill in my brows. Um, I'm using MAC Espresso and the Delium 763 brush. It's just an angled brush. The 90s brow was, to me, kind of big and messy. I picture Brooke Shields. They try to make everything seem very natural. I don't even think they even like did anything to their, uh, to their brows back then. Okay, for the eyes, uh, it's really simple. I'm going to apply this eye primer. This is the Laura Geller uh, Spackle Hues in Mauve Majesty. This is just uh, gonna act as a primer. And the colors I'm gonna use are this quad here or this palette here. And it's just very um, natural eye. So the first color I'm going to take is this one here. It's a like satiny type taupe color. And I'm going to take it on a smaller brush. Oh, not this one. And place this in the inner portion of my lid. And 
using the same brush I'm going to go into this next color here and I'm going to place this in the outer portion just making that V shape and I'm also going to take this one under the lash line Now I'm gonna go in with my blending brush and blend out that outer V. So now I'm just gonna take a very small brush and put a little bit of that um, beige color just in the brow highlight. Okay, now I'm gonna take that same brush that I was using earlier, and I'm gonna take this um, cocoa color here, and that's gonna go in that, um, on the lid there. Kind of marry the two colors. And then again, go in with my blending brush. And blend those two together. And last, <clears throat> on the lash line, I'm going to apply the black kind of line my eyes with it and then again going into that brush and blending it into the other color now for the cheeks the colors uh, were tawny they were cinnamon they were colors like that, um, but I'm gonna go with this um, NYX blush in the color Angel, just because it's got a little bit more peach than Tawny, and um, it goes with my skin tone a little bit better. I'm gonna take the Delium 960 brush, moving on, um, I'm just going to curl my lashes and apply my mascara. I'm using the Tarte Lash Curler and the mascara I'm using is the Voluminous False Fiber Lashes from L'Oreal. It's a really good one, however, I bought it in brown. So, yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna do that off camera and I'll be right back. Okay, so we're done with the eyes pretty much. And like I said, it's just your satiny finish and it's all browns and taupes. So, so moving on to the lips and I have three different colors for you. They're all from Wet n Wild and they're all um, perfect 90s colors. Um, and the reason I got these is because I wanted to go into the trend, but I don't really want to invest so much in it because it's just a trend. So if you have the money to invest in the trend, I mean, go ahead, but I just really didn't want to. I'm gonna use the brown one. Wow, these go on so creamy. So there you have it, my brown lips. This one I think um, is it goes with the trend a lot more so yeah I hope that you like this look it's definitely a little bit out there um, but it's the trend it's what's going on now that 90s um, look I'll talk to you guys later bye